Pro Football Weekly is taking a look at the top free agents this year. Right now we're talking about Pierre Garçon. And we know Reggie Wayne's a free agent. We know that he's been very good for a long time. Garçon's kind of just come on the scene. Just how good is he? I think we just saw the, the tip of the iceberg last year with Garçon. He's coming off a career year. He's uh, on paper, the measurables, they, they jump off the chart. I mean, he, he looks like a true number one with his size and his speed combination. He has the, you know, the acrobatic qualities in, in terms of his catching radius. He'll go out there and get it anywhere. The problem is that he drops the easy ones, the ones that are right on his hands. So the inconsistency is the big issue. The better question may be not how good is he now, but how good can he be? He's 25 years old. Um, really, the, the sky's the limit for him at this point, we'll say that. I mean, and he made Curtis Painter look good at times, which is like a miracle in itself. So you gotta figure another quarterback he can definitely make good as well. He turned down reportedly a huge deal already, a five-year offer. Do you see him getting number one receiver money? Uh, you know, I think with the need that's out there, I mean, I think there's some guys that I know I would rather have, but like we just talked about, he's 25 years old. I think there's so much upside. I could see him getting paid, getting some offers like a number one guy. It sounds like maybe he got offered something close to that with the Colts. And uh, from everything we're hearing, you know, certainly talks are not off. That's pretty much more posturing. I expect the Colts to come back with a with a counter offer, and I really think that they're going to go all in on trying to bring him back. They need to get Andrew Luck some help. Don't have much for him right now, and this is a kid with a lot of upside. So if Wayne does leave and follows maybe Peyton wherever he goes, you think that they're going to go all out? You think he stays in Indy, Garcon? I think he does, yeah. I think they're going to do what it takes to bring him back. As I mentioned, Luck doesn't have a lot of help right now. You've got to have a guy to, to help, you know, bring them in together, and I think that guy can be Pierre Garcon. He's got a long ways to go until he is a true number one, but I think that, you know, tantalizing upside is what's going to get the Colts and what's going to get him back in Indy. you got to have something there to help out whoever the quarterback is, and, you know, whether it's Austin Collie or Dallas Clark, you figure having Pierre Garcon there would certainly help. You can find out what's going on with him as he goes through the whole free agency process. Just be sure to subscribe to us on YouTube or go to ProFootballWeekly.com. It's never too early to start thinking about the NFL Draft, and Pro Football Weekly's new draft database has you covered. Check out updated player rankings for over 750 prospects and our exclusive PFW Stockwatch. Just go to the Draft tab at ProFootballWeekly.com.